Hello, my name is Vladimir. I work in Teloka. It's a crowdsourcing platform that can help you collect a lot of data in a very short time. As you know, artificial intelligence and machine learning are here to stay. They are a normal part of our day-to-day -day routines, from web surfing and getting a taxi to shopping and playing games with friends. All these products and services are supported by three pillars of modern AI. First, algorithms and methods for AI models. Second, computing power. And the third, data and data production, in particular data labeling. Currently, the algorithms and hardware have become commodities and they are easily available. As for the third pillar, it's not that easy. It may sound strange at first, but fiddling with data is more time consuming than creating new models. Data scientists spend the most time collecting and cleaning data. Unfortunately, the AI community neglected to develop the practices of reliable data collection, a backbone of fair and trustworthy AI. We in Teloka believe that in the nearest future, data production will be the main focus of AI community. But why do we need to put so much effort into data? Because improving the data is a straightforward way to improve the quality of AI products. You can do this in several ways. By increasing the data quality, you have heard the phrase garbage in, garbage out. Bad quality input data cannot produce good output. By adding more data into your training set, the model can only rely on what it has seen. The more data you have, the better you train your formulas and the better they work. If your data lacks important edge cases, chances are they will be missing from the model and the model will be inadequate in more general settings. And by improving your data pipelines, that may lead to faster validation and implementation of new models. If you're able to verify, test, and validate new models without having to wait for a month to collect additional data, you can move much faster. To make use of these approaches, you need to know how to set up pipelines for data collection and data labeling. Whether you're into statistical learning or neural networks, a large label data set is a must. The exact size may depend on your task or network architecture. But even for a simple model to recognize a kitten or puppy, it needs to see thousands of examples and only people can make these training sets. Also, a collection with automatically selected images will need a human creator. And for more creative tasks, humans are indispensable. Focusing on more features may lead to the curse of dimensionality. While dimensionality increases, the volume of the space increases so fast that the available data becomes sparse. An increase in dimensionality leads to such a space extension that available data becomes sparse really fast. Even a small increase in the dimensionality would require a large increase in the volume of the data necessary to maintain similar level of performance. In a sense, data points become more unique and the model faces the risk of overfeeding. The model can memorize these unique objects as a result, this makes it harder to find patterns and perform well in real-life situations. We can apply dimensionality reduction methods or improve the situation by adding new observations. A small increase in dimensionality would require a large increase in the volume of the data in order to maintain similar level of performance. How can you get data for your project? For the most common machine learning tasks, you can use the training data sets that have been around for a long time. Another option is to look for data on Kaggle. Actually, the source of data is the issue many data scientists struggle with. They usually opt for Kaggle and some given data sets. Unfortunately, such data sets are not enough for more complex and interesting tasks. In many cases, ready-made solutions are just not available. As you know, Kaggle only offers labeled data sets for specific tasks. But in real-life business settings, the tasks are much broader and require work within the whole pipeline of machine learning production. Data is crucial for developing new models in a new domain. Takeaways. In this video, we discussed the importance of data collection and labeling for modern AI. Data quality and quantity are the keys to fast and scalable AI development. If you are working in a new area or developing new models, you probably need new data sets adequate for the task. 
If you want more features in your model, collect more observations to avoid overfitting and the curse of dimensionality. In the next videos, we will be talking about crowdsourcing as a methodology for data collection and labeling. See you soon!